Hello friends and welcome to the channel once again. So this video is about a software update with respect to the operating system of Samsung QN90C which you are seeing in front of you. So एक या दो दिन पहले मेरे पास एक software update आया था that the TV uh, there is an update of the operating system of uh, this uh, mini LED television. So as you must uh, some of you must be knowing Samsung doesn't uses Google's Android platform as operating system. They use their own proprietary Tizen operating system. So, उसमें उन्होंने एक दो तीन काफी सारे changes करे हैं. First of all, the name I believe has been changed from Tizen to One UI, Samsung One UI. And on top of it, they have included some uh, algorithms to customize it for the individual users to make it more uh, individual driven content. So, उसमें काफी तो 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 काफी सारे चेंजेस हैं विच आई जस्ट वॉन्टेड टू शो यू एन अपडेट यू सो द टेलीविजन विच यू आर सीन इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू इज सैमसंग टू एन नाइनटी सी दिस इज अ ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री मॉडल एंड दिस इज अ मिनी एल ई डी बेस्ड टेलीविजन तो जैसे ही आप इसको ऑन करते हैं नाउ द यू आई लुक्स लाइक दिस अर्लियर इट यूज टू लुक समथिंग डिफरेंट नाउ इट लुक्स लाइक दिस and if you see on the right hand side first of all you have three tabs for you live and apps in front of you so for you if you see on the left hand side there is a tile of smart things so if you click on this then it will take you to a widget where they have categorized they have given you the option to categorize the content into favorites based on favorites based on devices based on your life and routines these are self explanatory options and aap khud se dekhenge to aap samajh jayenge that for example if let's say uh, if i use any particular device or routine or services that i use most often so that can be put in my favorites and uh, uh, so and so that's that's basically how the categorization has been done and if you see on the top now if you see the it shows the cat it shows the various ott platforms in this view for example if i'm watching netflix and the last series i was watching on netflix is i am a killer then it will show that in the first tile just below smart things then you have then it will suggest you the content based on your watching browsing history so for example you have chucky you have the newly recently added khel khel mein then you have best of prime videos best for kids this is how the layout has been changed so you can have quick quick access of the content which you like the most and uh, through the layout so it is quite similar it also has trending and then you have obviously the youtube options preferences continue watching parental log etc so the, as you can see the layout has been changed quite a bit and it has been made very user friendly now relatively to as it was before and if you go to the my life my life uh, section then you have the various news channels which are live and you can also choose to download various apps from the app store so this is not this is not google's app store this is samsung's own app store one more thing that has changed is the animation so for example if i am clicking on the settings option on the remote and if you see on the bottom left hand side you have three icons and if you click and if you see the settings icon now gets able like this and you have downloaded apps you have the settings and you have the icon and if you click on this then it takes you to the different settings options so this is one thing that they have changed another thing which they have changed is if we see go up if we go up to for you and if we go to let's say uh youtube for example if we go to youtube now this is how the animation has been changed earlier it was different earlier it was different now it is different now it is a blue a light like you saw this the sweetness so this is actually an update from samsung with respect to its tizen ui and as you can see it has been made lot more user friendly it has been made lot more easy for the for the owner 
to access their favorite contents to basically categorize their favorite contents and the most important benefit which i see in this new update is how the segregation and sorting of the content is done so this is done in a very 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 good manner very easy manner so for example if i want to access my favorites or favorite uh, series or favorite uh, ott service then it gives me a one click option to access this one. so <clears throat> this is a small update which samsung has given and i just wanted to give you a brief update on this ab is television ka ek successor aa chuka i believe samsung's qn90d i haven't got the chance to see the television in the store but as soon as i as i visit the store i'll make a video on that as well so this is all about the update samsung's one ui from samsung tizen i hope you found this information relevant in case you did please do like share comment and subscribe to the channel we'll see you next time